UCMR3 539 Sampling Instructions Wash your hands before sampling and wear the powderless nitrile gloves which are included in the kit during sampling and sample handling. Your 539 kit should include three empty sample bottles with preservatives, one trip blank bottle with reagent water and preservative, and one empty field blank bottle. Some compounds have the potential to be sources of random field contamination which could lead to false positive results in your samples. Because of this, the EPA is requiring that each sample for Method 539 also have a field blank collected at the same site. The collection protocol for Method 539 requires that you take the sample of reagent water with preservatives pre-added provided to you in the bottle labeled trip blank and pour it into the empty bottle labeled field blank while at the site, but before collecting samples. Cap both the now empty trip blank bottle and the filled field blank bottle. Put both bottles into the cooler and ship both the trip blank and the field blank back to the lab along with the samples. Be very careful during sample collection. Any detections in the sample will require an analysis of the field blank. If there are any detections in the field blank, a resample will be required by the EPA. Before sampling, remove the aerator and screen if sampling from a faucet or tap. Open the tap and let the water run at fast flow for approximately 5 minutes. Before filling, label bottles with required information that is not already pre-printed such as the sample ID, date, and time of collection. After 5 minutes, slow water flow to thickness of a pencil to minimize splashing. Start sample collection by filling the sample bottle up to the bottom of the neck, taking care not to flush out preservatives and making sure the mouth of the bottle does not come in contact with anything other than sample water. Cap and invert the bottle at least five times to mix the sample with the preservative. Place the sample into the cooler. Collect sample for the other two sample bottles by repeating the previous sample collection procedures. Place all of the samples into the cooler and ship back to the lab. Please refer to Eurofin's Eaton Analytical's written sampling instructions for specific details.